welcome to my channel it's Amy and we are doing a Too Faced gingerbread spice review so I have spiced up my eyes with the gingerbread hmm anyways um, I've used this a couple times and I really like the colors in the palette so this is like the just reminiscent of Too Faced with the metal palette um, the pan sizes are, are good size overall. I don't know how, how fast you could go through one of these two face palettes. So the smell, the smell is really light, very, very light. I was actually um, thinking it would have more of a true gingerbread smell and it has more, ouch. I don't know. It, I wouldn't say vanilla, but it is so so light and I've had this palette for maybe a couple weeks and I've noticed the scent is getting lighter so I don't expect it to be around very long but what do I think about the palette overall so today I used um, some I used a lot of colors I, I used some powdered sugar some spiced eggnog oh snap oh burn little spiced rum reindeer paws and gingerbread latte and some figgy pudding so I went in big go big or go home go big go home to create this eye look so a couple things on the palette um this spice rum really dry don't know what happened these ones when I used them doot, and doot, those are went on really nice I didn't have um, any problems as far as it being dry etc they they were creamy this spiced rum for whatever reason like flaky dry so that was kind of weird kind of weird um, I like all the colors I like the the pop of magenta we've got some purples we've got some earth tones we have some shimmer shades this color right here frostbite me oh my gosh in fact i should have probably used that as a highlight let's try that because i got sidetracked and didn't do a highlight so this frostbite me i think is really the whole reason why i bought the palette look how pretty that is and that's just as a highlight um i just fell in love with the frostbite me so too bad I didn't, you know, they didn't have a massive pan like this to frostbite me so you could just like bathe in it because it's absolutely awesome. So yeah, I really like how all the, the colors go together. Um, having it at an angle for whatever reason, I'm seeing that these might be another good eye look. So I may have to dip into this again. Um, so yeah, it's just, it's it was a fun fun palette. This reindeer paws actually picked up really good in the corner as far as the darkness goes. Um, the figgy pudding I patted on, really good color payout. So I, I do like the color payout there um, better than the pumpkin spice that they had put out. So yeah, I really like this uh, Too Faced palette. I think it's absolutely cute and I like on the inside it says bite me. So if you have had used this palette, kind of tell me what your thoughts are. I've Again, I, I've had a good time using it. Other than that one color that seems to be a little chunky and dried out, everything else has, has worked well. So if you want to see how I created this multiple color eye look using, I don't know, it seemed like half of these. Half. Probably not half. Stay tuned. Oh, good morning, Miss. Okay, so I've been using the Too Faced Gingerbread Spice Palette, and it is nice. So the smell, like the peach palettes really have a smell. This one is, is kind of light. So all the colors are great for fall, even though this is a Gingerbread Spice Palette. And so, yeah, we're going to have some fun with it. I've used it a couple times, and I kind of like the colors. It's got some pinks and some browns and some purples and some greens. All right, so today I'm going to do a bit of a purple eye. I think for my base, I want to have some looky at my cookie. And I'm going to use this almost all over the eye. I am going to pick up some of the browns 
which we're gonna take this gingerbread latte and I'm gonna grab a little bit smaller brush. I'm gonna grab a soft down brush from Makeup Geek and get off that excess. I'm gonna pick up some figgy pudding. Figgy, figgy, figgy. Oh, don't you see what you do, you do to me. And I am gonna be very careful with the fallout on this one. And I am patting this on to get a good color payout. Picking back up the brush I used with gingerbread latte, I'm just gonna kinda pick up a little bit of the fallout still left in the pan. Grabbing a blending brush, I'm just going to kind of blend those two together. I'm going to carve out a crease. I'll be right back. All carved and ready to wreck and roll. I'm having issues. I want to use all the colors. I think I'm going to pick up the spiced eggnog here. And then, okay, this is where I'm... I'm not sure what to do next. So I do want to pick up the... Ooh, burn... But I like the oh snap for the purple. So what I may do is pick up some of the oh snap to give it just a little hint. And I don't want to say peach because that's not it. It's almost kind of a mauve color. Okay, and then I am going to go pick up ooh burn or oh burn, not ooh, oh. And I'm going to kind of go in between the O-Snap and, oh, I could have picked up that spiced rum. Dang it. Well, let's pull a little spiced rum on top of it. Although that one seems really dry in comparison. That one seems very dry compared to the O-Burn. Now I'm going to pick up this color here called Reindeer Paws because I always like a little bit of a dark color right there. And Rob is out of town. So I don't want to look as tired as I feel since I have no coffee. So we're going to pick up some powdered sugar on this little round brush, which is fully awesome. If you want the corner of your eye, it's like pop. Now this other color here, Frostbite Me, I used in another eye look. And I'm not sure if I have any other eye looks. If I do, I'll pop them in this video. But this is really, really nice. I mean, it's just frostbite me is a perfect, perfect way of describing it. So I'm going to pick up some reindeer paws on that flat brush. Flat yet slightly fluffy to get the lower lash line and the upper lash line touching. Today, I think I'm going to use the Marc Jacobs. This color is in Mist Me. And that's just kind of to highlight the inner waterline and maybe look, make it look a little brighter. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and finish my upper eyeliner, mascara, and false eyelashes off camera. So Thank here we go. Thank you so much for joining today using the Gingerbread Spice palette from Too Faced. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. As always, you have a choice. Make it a great one. Until next time, see ya.